Taking a look at stock ticker symbol HTCO over here on investorshangout.com. As of right now, you guys are currently traded at $1.83, and that is going to be as of today with a thousand shares being traded. The average volume for the last 20 days has been about 3,000 shares. With that being said, the big thing that's going to come down to this one is just going to be volume. Take a look over here on 11.3. Okay, so that's going to be uh, not even a week ago. You guys had 11,000 shares being traded and you opened at $1.28 hitting the high of 201, tapping slightly above that resistance level at $2. What does that tell me? That tells me one thing. This thing likes to move on volumes, uh, volume rather. And that's what we're going to be watching for with this one. You guys are technically in the bullish territory above the 30-day simple moving average now uh, following this line down. Here we go with this 30-day simple moving average. If you see that, look at how a majority of those candles are all underneath that 30-day simple moving average. But right now, that has seemed to be shifting around and now you guys are above the 30-day simple moving average after that move over here on 11.3. You guys are going to have some uh, support levels over here at the dollar eighty mark. A dollar eighty. Let's go ahead and update that. There we go with that. A dollar eighty and sixty six, and then a dollar fifty seven twenty. That's going to be the thirty day simple moving average. You guys are going to have some resistance levels up here at the dollar eighty five and the two dollar mark. I do like this one uh, as far as the way that it looks, but the only thing that it's going to need is volume here. So a dollar eighty three is what we're going to put in here for our current level. A dollar eighty five. Uh, followed up by the two dollar mark in your support levels underneath this at a dollar eighty, followed up by a dollar sixty six, and then a dollar fifty seven twenty will move much higher and faster with volume. In my opinion so we know what we're watching for your support and resistance levels but really all ultimately comes down to volume we want to see that volume coming in i would watch for that and remember when you see that volume start coming in i think that this one's going to start making some moves so i'm going to keep this one on our radar moving forward htco if you follow the stock make sure you hit that like and subscribe we'd appreciate it you can join us for our next live show investorshangout.com forward slash live and you can check the links in the description below for all of the pages that we just talked about so you can stop by and join us for our next live show.